guys. Today, we called Pomni at 3 a.m. And let me tell you, it was not a good idea. She was acting really weird and going crazy about the exit. And before you knew it, something really bad happened. Bro, I told you this is gonna be a really bad idea. It's literally my worst nightmare. It's 3 a.m. and you wanna call the amazing digital circus characters? All right, I'm paying to unlock his phone number. Let's see. Ah, uh, Jax, you there, buddy? Sonny, Sonny, relax. I, I just want to clear a few things up with Jax. Yeah, dude, he's hecka chill. Yo, Jax. Maybe I should take a quick pic of him? Nah, bro, Jax the homie. He always picks up. Yeah, and I, I don't know what he wants with us. He hasn't even said a word yet. Jax, talk to me. Um, uh, question, Jax. Are, are you gonna let Pomni leave the circus soon? Uh, sure. Sonny, why is he standing next to an exit door? There's not supposed to be an exit door in the digital circus. I have a feeling he's gonna press this button and unveil something at the circus. It looks like we're in the stands right now. Oh no. Why is he waving goodbye and being really creepy? What does he want from us? Sonny, I kind of regret calling Jax. Imagine he ditches, bro, and we find him inside of our house. It'll be your fault, bro, not mine. Uh, hi, Jax. Also, Jax kind of looks sad now. What is going on? I don't know. I just, I just want him to stay in the circus. Hopefully, that exit door doesn't lead to our place. Ah! No. Okay. Let's just message him. Jax, why did you scare us? Because he wants to leave, Sonny. Y yeah, that's what I just asked. Yeah, why? Um, Sonny? Sonny! Is Pomni okay? Why? No. Question mark, though? What is going on with Jax, bro? He's not making any sense. Hey? What? <laughs> what is going on? What did you do with Pomni, Jax? What is wrong with him? Maybe, maybe, wait a second. Are you okay? Did someone kidnap you? I I have a feeling Kane took him. Ask what he did with Pomni. Oh no. Kane, do you think maybe we can help him? <gasps> I'm gonna tell him to check for an exit door, bro. We've gotta find a way to send Jax an exit door, but he doesn't even understand. If you tire, just exit. He's tired of the digital circus, Sonny. He just wants to leave. Why? Yeah, I think he's lost his mind, but I'm gonna try one more thing. Jax, you oogly. Let's see what he says. Who even made this place? Bro, I'm out. Bro, Jax is confusing me, dude. Maybe we should call someone else from the digital circus. Psst, Pomni, is everything okay? Yo, why are you being so mean, Sonny? Yes, she's typing back. Jax has lost his mind. We should check up on Pomni and see what happened to her. Are you trapped at the circus, Pomni? I'm not asking what happened. I'm confused now. Uh, Sonny, I think she's at the circus. Hold on, hold on. Let me investigate this. Maybe I created this. Wait, what? You created the circus? Ellen, we're finding out some new lore. This is insane. Sonny, I don't think they know how to type. Maybe we should just call them. No, no you. <laughs> Let's see what she says now. But why would she do that? She hates the circus. Cool, we will call you. I'm giving her a call. No. Omni, pick up. Yes. I'll wake up soon. Except she's standing in front of the exit door. Let me take a photo of this for Kane. I hope she's doing all right. Omni, talk to us. Oh, no. She looks a bit hypnotized right now. It's the same thing, Sonny. The same thing as before. Like what? Yeah, Kane is not going to be happy. <laughs> Bro, I think she's going to get trapped. Yo, she's performing. And... She looks really sad, Sonny. Maybe we should do something to cheer her up. She's gone. I don't think she's getting out of the circus, Melon. I'm pretty sure she's going to get lost in the void. Pomni, Pomni. You'll one day make it out of the circus, hopefully. Hey, Pomni. I just want to ask you a question about Kane. Oh, no! I don't think she likes talking about Kane very much. I don't think she likes talking about Kane. Oh, no. I hope she's doing all right, though. Yeah, I think the only thing to make me feel better is if I give my pal Billy a call. I think Big Billy is chilly. Is he gonna answer? Neither do I, Sonny. That was terrifying. Yo, Billy, you there? Oh, that was kind of creepy. Bill? You think Bill's chill, or do you think Bill's not chill? What is he doing? Is he depressed? Oh, you're right. He always gets banned from Roblox, but they brought him back, so 
So I think at the end of this, he should be happy. Look at that smile. Aww. Oh, Bill looks so sad. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm snapping pics. Billy is sad, bro, because he got banned. I don't think he liked me taking that photo, Melon. Uh, Billy? Oh, he's walking out here. Uh, that is terrifying, Sonny. Absolutely terrifying. Yo, he is sneaking around. And this looks like the original Roblox map, and he's trying to hack into it. What does that say? Bring back Billy. Ah! Photo, 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 hang up, hang up. Oh, oh. Melon, I can't do this anymore. I'm not calling anyone else at 3 a.m. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, before we go to bed, please press that like button to support our channel. And uh, definitely don't call the digital circus at 3 in the morning. Yeah, bro, we should probably just go to sleep. Today we play Brookhaven Hide and Seek, but the wheel spinner had some crazy options on it. I couldn't even breathe air during a hide and seek game. Let's try to get 696 new viewers to subscribe. Subscribe and get goaded right now. And can we crush a gigantic like goal of just 1.5 likes? Thank you. It's Brookhaven Hide and Seek Melon. And in this one versus one, we're gonna spin a mystery wheel that decides which element we cannot touch. Oh my God, bro. Please just don't give me air. That's like an instant death. Okay, Melon. Do you want the first or second spin? Bro, hit me with the first spin. Here you go, buddy boy. Give him air. Give him air. Yo, Earth? That's like the second worst one. That means you can't touch grass, dirt, plants, trees, nothing that's nature. Bro, that means I'm limited to the concrete jungle. That's right, brother. You in these screets, dog. Run it. You got two minutes to hide. Good luck, Melon. Okay, okay. Okay, guys. This is actually a tough one, dude. I can't go, like, anywhere outside the city. I gotta be careful around these ferns, too. Here's my plan. I'm gonna hop in the helicopter and see what spots are available to me. Yo, guys, are you hearing that? I'm not supposed to cheat and look, but I'm pretty sure I hear a helicopter right now. What the heck, bro? bro? You don't hear anything. You don't hear anything. You shouldn't even be able to hear me right now, Melon. I see your stupid helicopter. Okay, I won't cheat. I'm looking away. I'm looking away. Okay, guys, I'm gonna hide in this little random... I don't even know. This is like an abandoned house. This little country home. Jump out! Let's go! Oh my god, I was so close to touching a tree. And I jump down. It's abandoned home. And I guess this is my new spot for the time being. Okay, Sonny, I'm ready. Dude, I'm coming to get you fast. I saw the helicopter out here, so I'm gonna head this way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm totally in that direction. Yo, I'm cruising in. You need a pickup, bro? I'm a taxi driver. And I go quick with it. As long as there's no plants in there. Ooh, good idea. Is there an all-natural vehicle? Nah, not really. You're lucky. Wait, I'm a melon. Does that mean I can't be myself? Oh my god. You're right. That melon cap, that's part of Earth. You're dead, bro. Wait, 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 wait. Chill, 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 chill. I, I don't know what melon cap you're talking about, dude. What, what melon cap? All right. I'll give it to you this time. You just lucked out. Bro, where are are you? Just chilling. First question. Are you on the edge of the map somewhere? Because I could have swore I saw your helicopter out here. No comment. Oh my god, guys. What if he's on the top near the drones? That's why he had the helicopter. Come on. Vroom, vroom. Let's go, taxi. Get out me car. Get out me car. I will find you. And when I do melon, I will farm you. What? You're not up there. I walk this lonely road and I walk alone and I walk alone. So lonely, sunny. Oh my god. <laughs> my taxi. That did not go well. Melon, second question. Are you inside or outside? I mean, I guess I'm inside. Are you in here? You're not at the water Bye, slide area? Guy. Nope. Not at summer camp? Nope. For my last question, are you near the summer camp? <laughs> Absolutely not, dude. I'm nowhere even close to that. Nowhere even close to that. That gives me an idea. Roll out! Let's go! Opposite side of the map. I'll be there eventually. Good luck, my friend. Bruh, I've been out here on these streets for a minute. You're not on this concrete jungle. Where are you? <gasps> I think I know where you are. I see a building. What do you mean you see a building? I see a little red speck in the window. Yo, Dude. what are you talking about? What are you talking about? What are you talking you're about? Out here at Golden Ranch. I see you, Melon. No, you don't. I don't know what you're talking about. Where'd you go? What the heck? You were in here. You're hiding in the counters. You're hiding in the counters. <gasps> there he is. Look at this no! cute guy. Got no, him. bro. Should have ran on the roof. You should have hid in the cabinets, bro. Whatever, bro. I almost had you. You were lost for a while there. My turn to spin. Come on, give me something good. Give him air, give him air, give him air. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. That's really bad. Bro, you're literally going to die. No, I can get in the water quick. But well, there's a will. 
There's a way! I'm alive, Melon! Look at me! Bro, you're so cheeky. I'll let it slide. I'll let it slide, bro. Dude, I'm the goat. Look, I even have an oxygen pack. Look at me. I'm set, dude. You can't breathe that. That's air. You gotta hold your breath, dude. You got 20 seconds of breath holding. Air technically has carbon dioxide and other elements. My oxygen pack is pure O2. Whatever, bro. Go find a spot. If you're exposed to air when I start seeking, you're dead. Okay, fine. Come on. I gotta find a sweet spot. I got to find a sweet spot. Man, guys, I thought I was smart slapping this astronaut outfit on. I thought it was gonna protect me from the elements, but Melon's kind of right. Air is, is still air, so <laughs> this is kind of rough. It's okay, though. I know what I've got to do. I've gotta sneak into the police station real quick, and let me show you why. Open up cell number two, and jump into the vents, and now that I'm upstairs, I gotta go through the secret wall into the back room, and I gotta grab something on the back of this this filing cabinet. And now that I've taken the swipe card from the police station, it's time to head to Brookhaven Electrical. That's where I'ma be hiding out. I did it. I am at Brookhaven Electrical. Let's go. I'll leave my car there to give Melon a little bit of a chance. And then I come over to the entrance and open sesame. Boom. I'm in. And now I'm secured. This is an air-free space. I'm good. Melon, try to find me, dog. You got two minutes. Actually, I'll give you three minutes. Okay, buddy. I'm on my way. Now, where would the sunny hide where there's no air? I think you're on your way to a quick L, brother. Dude, we'll see about that. For my first question, are you inside or outside? I'm inside. I have to be. What a dumb question. I don't know, bro. Maybe you're hiding underwater. True. That could have been smart, actually. I guess for my second question, are you towards the edges of the map or are you in the city? Heck nah, brother. There's too much air in the city. Wait, what was that? What was what? Bro, what's that purple thing right here? Bro, yeah. I found your car. You're near the solar panels, bro. I left it there to distract you. It's a diversion. It's a diversion. Yeah, I'm sure it's a diversion. Bro, are you in Brookhaven Electrical? I don't know what you're talking about. Guys, this is not good. At least Melon's dumb. He doesn't know about the blue swipe key. Bro, I can't sleeping bag in. Dude, I'm not in Brookhaven Electrical. I don't even know how to get in there. That's sus. Bro, I know you know about the secret, but guess what? So do I. Just gotta find the blue swipe card. Wait, what secret? What do you mean? Blue swipe? What? What are you talking about? Okay, I gotta head over to the police station. That's it, guys. While he's doing that, I need to find a way to glitch. Please. Please. Oh, wait, it's in the vents. It's in the vents. There's nothing in the vents. Just leave it alone. Oh, here, it's on the side. Here we go. Give me that swipe card. Give me that swipe card. Nothing's working, guys. I'm trying. It won't work. I'm coming back, Sonny. I'm almost there. And the best part is you can't even leave because you would get exposed to air and die. Who says I'm even in there? Okay, guys, this is really bad. Bro, I know you're in there. Your car is there. That's like the only airtight place near your car. Let's enter the key card. Now the door's open. Why is there a car in here? What are you talking about? There's nothing in there. Where are you? I'm in Brookhaven's fountain, dog. Dude, I can't see anything. Dude, I have to shrink down. I literally have to shrink melon, down. Melon, your stupid melon cap. Leave it where it is. Don't get smaller. Leave it where it is. We're going in, boys. Yo, you're right next to me. Let's go. Dude, I couldn't use sleeping bags, ladders, traffic cones. Nothing would work in here except spawning cars. Guess what? I'm going to expose you to the elements. Expose this. Oh my god, I can't see anything. That's that's right. Eat my semi truck. Bro, why are you allowed to spawn that in? I'm keeping myself airtight. I really hope you get water or fire. Actually, electricity would be sick too. They're all Bro, good. All of these are good. All of these are good, dude. Fire, let's go. You're gonna burn. Yeah, right, bro. How? How is a fire gonna hit me in this game? What, am I gonna walk into the one fireplace on the map? <laughs> Melon, you've got two minutes to hide. And remember, if you touch anything that's remotely on fire, you lose. Okay, buddy. Good thing there's none of those in Brookhaven. Why are you going to the fire station right now, dude? That's a terrible spot. What do you mean, dude? It's perfect. There's never gonna be a fire there. Right, whatever you say, dude. You're dead. Okay, guys. I think I'm gonna do a house spot for this round. So I'm just gonna check the locations. Yeah. Indeed. Wait, Sonny didn't close his house from last video. Wait a second. Dude, and it's unlocked? Bro, let's go. Dude, he's never gonna suspect me being in here. Where do I hide? Where do I hide? Guys, Melon's a cringe lord. He went in my house and I'm just spying on him with my security cam now. Oh, this is gonna be so easy. Okay, guys, if for some reason Sonny decides to check his house, I'm gonna be hiding in the kitchen sink just to make sure there's no chance he finds me. So now all I gotta do is sit down and... 
and wait, wait, lay down. And now I'm completely disguised. Okay, Sonny, I'm ready whenever you are. Let's go. Melon, this about to be a speed run. I've got some bad news for you, buddy. What's the bad news, Shiny? You got tricked into hiding in my house. I knew it'd be too tempting. I knew you'd do it. That's why I made my house red like a melon. Bro, what? The question is, where in my house are you? That's gonna be the issue now. Where do I hide? Probably no, probably no. You're in the laundry machine! Wait, why am I stuck? So, wait, you don't know? You don't know? You're not in the laundry machine, dryer. You're not in here either. Where did you go? He doesn't know. He doesn't know. Did you go upstairs? Are you taking over my bedroom? You nasty dog. Get out of there. Oh, I would never do such a thing. You totally would. Okay, guys. What Melon doesn't realize is he's in my own house. So I can open this up and select fire. He's dead, bro. Once this loads in, he's so dead. <laughs> Do you smell that? It smells like burning melons! Yo! No! I'm tired! Yo! The fire got you, bro! Let's go! That round of hide and seek goes to me! Easy win! Bro, you're such a cheater! Dude, you hid inside my house! That was your mistake! Bro, I didn't think you'd be cheating and using the security cameras! It's the last spin! Will I get water or electricity? Oh, let's go! Are you kidding me, bro? This is gonna be easy! Whatever, dude! You got two minutes to hide. Good Yo, luck. chill, chill, chill. Two minutes, two minutes, two minutes. Where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? Okay, guys, I'm spawning in the big boy truck and I'm gonna drive it into Lake Madison because I'm an absolute animal. As long as I don't touch the water, we're chilling. Yeah? I'm good. I'm goaded. Look at me now. I'm not touching it. I'm just small enough. Let's go. Hopefully it doesn't get any deeper though or I might die. Where do we park this behemoth now? I think right behind the yacht. It's just an extension of the yacht now. Nothing to see here. This is perfectly normal. Very reasonable. And now can I like get in the back of the caboose? Perfect. I'm in the back. It's harder to see me. I'm not touching the water. It's really close. My feet almost went in, but we're good. Melon, I'm ready. Alright, bro. I'm on my way. Where's the sunny boy hiding? Okay, guys. Melon's on his way. I'm gonna take the trailer off the back so he thinks I'm in there. This could be good. This could be good. And then I'm gonna write not in here. And I'm gonna make this truck yellow. Perfect. He'll never suspect For it. For my first question, Sonny, are you doing something cheeky? I mean, I'm always doing something cheeky, so that's a dumb question. The answer is yeah. Of course I am. Bro, I have a sneaking suspicion I know what you're doing. Yeah, what's that? I feel like you're near Lake Madison because that's the last place I'd expect to go. Well, good luck finding me because I am not in there. Yeah? Why is there a giant semi-truck then next to the yacht? I don't know. I'm not in it. It says Sonny isn't here? No, it says not in here. Bro, you're definitely in here. No, it clearly is labeled. I'm not in there, dude. Alright, I got a sleeping bag in. I got a sleeping bag in. I can't sleeping bag. Wait, 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 wait. I did this once before with a bike. Bro, chill. I'm not in there. I don't see him in here. I'm scouting it out with my melon dome. He's not in any of the boxes. I told you, I'm not in there. I'm not a liar. I'm cheeky, but I'm not Yo. a liar. Yo! No! Why did you go in there? Hey, nice seat, dude. Nice seat. Wait a second. What if I just drove this a little lower into the water? No, don't do it, melon. Don't do it! I can't drive this truck! God That's dang it! That's right. I stole the keys. No! I pressed jump! No! Look at this dead boy. That's it for Brookhaven Hide and Seek, but I can't breathe. Make sure you like and subscribe. In this video, Sunny and I play Hide and Seek in Brookhaven, but there's a twist. There's this really spooky house, and we play Hide and Seek in it at 3 a.m. It was terrifying. But you know what's not terrifying? Pressing that subscribe button. Could we get a thousand new subscribers? Subscribers from this video. Melon, it's time for Brookhaven Hide and Seek. And I've got some new secret spots up my sleeve. Okay, we'll see about that one, Sonny. If you've got so many secret spots, do you want to hide first? Dang right I do, bro. I'm out of here. See you, nerd. You got two minutes. Two minutes is lots of time, especially when I have a cute, tiny little bike. Look at me go. Beep, beep. Well, Melon's not even impressed by my wheels. He didn't say nothing. I didn't even see your wheels, bro. I'm sorry. Dude, you got a tiny little bike, boy. I know. I got these training wheels on it fresh from the store. I'm out of here, though. I'm about to take these off and go zoom in. Minute and a half left, Sonny. Let's go fast. Oh, that's not the speed that I wanted. <laughs> 35. Perfect. Okay, guys. It's time for me to show Melon a new top secret hiding spot. And to tell you the truth, I don't even have one. So I've got to do something super sus to throw him off my 
sent. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over here to house number 18. Then I'm gonna spawn it in. And we're gonna choose one of the new homes at least so he's suspicious of it. Yeah, let's go with the tropical house. And while that is spawning in, I'm gonna start to bike myself over to the stables. And now that I'm here, I'm gonna confuse Melon even more. Let's spawn in a horse. That's perfect. Nothing suspicious here. It's just a horse out of stables. And then I'm gonna run all the way back here. Sonny, you got 30 seconds left. That's lots of time, bro. It's all good. I'm gonna put on some fresh clothes. Yo, look at that scribbly little drawing. And then, with my perfect disguise, I'm gonna go lay down in the bushes. Yo, I don't even have to lay down. I can stand up tall. This is a thick bush. Yeah, I think I'm good. I'm just gonna vibe out here now. Melon, I'm ready. F -f -f Finally, Sonny. Now, I'm gonna find you in my epic car, bro. Check out my sports car. Check out my Benz. It goes super speedy. It's pretty sick and i'm gonna find you in it sunny where you at yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever you gotta do, bro. You're not gonna find me back here because I've got- Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. What'd you do? Nothing. I I, I might have added air support on accident, but I got rid of it. Wait a second, dude. First question then. Are you inside or outside? I'm outside. I think I have a sneaking suspicion on where you're at because you started panicking when I did that. Second question. Can you see me right now, Sonny? No. And guys, I gotta be fast. I gotta put a horse back here again. There we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Back to the grass. Back to the grass. Where are you, Sonny? Nowhere. Nowhere at all. Third and final question. Are you closer to the city or the outside of the map? I would argue I'm closer to the outskirts. Just a tiny bit closer to that. Yeah. Oh my lord, dude. Where the heck are you? I'm hiding in my favorite piece of property. You better not be in these long patches of grass. Oh, I don't even have a question to ask you. Dude hasn't even seen my house yet. Look at this doofus. Broski, where are you? You're out of questions. I don't have to answer anything. But you could, like, if you wanted to, I answer, like, another question. Okay, fine. I'll give you a hint. Just look for a house, you doofus. Bro, you said you're outside. Yeah, but you could be outside on a house property. Oh, my lord. This dude has got a house. Are you kidding me? It's got a pool and a nice property. Has a literal moat surrounding it. Yep, it sure does. And that moat might be just enough to keep me safe. Oh, I just drove past it. I gotta go this way. Yep, take a left. Then 300 meters, I gotta take a right. Oh! Uh, my car is malfunctioning. My car is malfunctioning. Flip over. Wait, if I press V. Nope, if I press H. Yo! Yo, guys, he's falling for it. He's gonna go check out my house. Wait a second, Sonny. This is way closer to the center of the map. Is it, though? Is it really? Yes! Wait, are you capping on me? Are you even in your house? <laughs> yeah, I don't have to answer that. Bro, you're not even in your house, are you? Oh my god, you're so cap. You're so full of cap. What do you mean? I'm so full of goat powers. I don't even know what goat powers are, but they're pretty great. Dude, I swear if you're in these grass fields, I'm gonna be so annoyed. No, my vehicle! Just look for my vehicle. It'll help you, and that's not cap. That's not cap? Wait, I don't even see your vehicle, though. Oh, you'll know when you see it. I'm looking right at my vehicle. I'm looking for a vehicle. Oh, my my cart just messed up. I fell over one more time. Let me flip that. I'm looking for a vehicle, Sonny. I'm not seeing one. Yeah, you might have to think outside of the box a little bit. It's not your standard edition vehicle. It's a little more organic. Bro, wait. I see a horse! Yo. No, he's on to me. He's outside. He can't be in the stables. He could be in any of these haystacks. Boy, I have a sneaking suspicion. He's in this grass over here. Come on. Come on. Uh, <laughs> Sunny. The funny thing about this grass is you can still see outside of the grass as clear as day. Get back here. No, you stole my vehicle. Oh, you're so slow. You're so slow. No, drive, drive drive let me back in let me in oh take the ramp and zoom yeah hey sonny no what how did you make it in let's go dang it i actually thought i got your vehicle and dip nah bruh i'm too goaded what are you wearing by the way i was gonna ask if you like my drawing yeah i made it it's you look you made that yourself dude that's a really good drawing but you don't see yourself in it what does that say kind it no dude this is like looking in a mirror for you it's a chicken 
one. See? Bro, that ain't me, dude. I'm I'm not. I don't look like that at all. You don't even have any red. You're a big chicken, bro. Get wrecked. Uh -huh, very funny. This big chicken's gonna run you over. Chill. Chill. Yo. Get flatlined. No, it flipped your vehicle, though. Get wrecked. Sonny, I'm gonna prove to you I'm not a chicken. This round, spin me a wheel of colors. Yo, are you serious? You want to get a designated color and you can only hide using it? Yeah, bro. Spin that wheel. Let's go. And credit where credit's due, Melon. You're not a coward. Yeah, bro, I'm a melon. Are you joking? What did I get, bro? You can only hide using the color green. Yo. Best color in the game. Best color in the game. All right, I'm out of here, Sonny. I'm dimming. Yeah, that's what a coward would do. They would get green. Yeah, yeah. Nice try. Stop trying to play me like this, Sonny. Whatever, bro. You got two minutes. Go find your hiding spot. No hiding in grass. That's my spot. Uh, no promises. <laughs> All right, guys. Check out my green whip because I can only hide using the color green. Now, where do I want to hide? I'm not going to hide in the grass because that would be too obvious. But I kind of want to make Sonny believe that I'm hiding in the grass. So he checks in the grass and then gets really mad at me for hiding in the grass because that would not be cool. Now, where do I actually want to hide? Hmm, this is a tough one. I'm just going to look around for a second. Wait, I think I know where I'm going to hide. Let me check this cave out. Is there grass in this cave? Yo, it's all grass in this cave. I just got to hide in my vehicle. So hopefully Sonny doesn't see it. And then he can't use it to defeat me. Put it in this crack right here. Yeah. My vehicle is hidden. And now I walk into this cave. Check it out. It's all green in here. So it's fair game. Now I just got to disguise myself a little bit. Yes, because. I'm green. No, my torso isn't green. Why does it do this? It's so annoying. Whatever. I'm shrinking down. I'm shrinking down real low. 0.5. Remove my face. And I'll keep the melon cap on because I'm goaded like that for real. Now I'm just going to go over in this corner and chill out. All right, Sonny. I'm ready. Let's do this thing. So I already know you can only hide using the color green. So my very first question I've got to use is, are you inside or outside? I am. I am outside or kind of inside, but outside. Wait, what? You're kind of inside, but you're mostly outside. Dude, that means you're hidden in like a cave or a crack in the map. What the heck? No. Okay, fine. Melon, are you hidden in a cave? Yeah. One question left, Sonny. That's fine. There's not many caves you could hide in. There's one at the waterfall and there's the agency cave. Where else is there a secret cave? You only have one minute left. What are you? No, what? Sorry, no. 30 seconds. 30 seconds left, Sonny. What? What is this timekeeping? You are the biggest capper of all time. Bro, it's been at least four minutes. Dude, whatever time zone you work in, I want nothing to do with it. I want my time to go slower, not faster. But I want it to go faster. Let's see. Is he in this cave? Dude, you're not in the waterfall cave. What a waste of my time. Dude, you that cave doesn't even have green in it, silly bean. Yes, it does. I'm looking at the wall. Come on, helicopter. Get out of here. Oh, no. I think I've made a very big mistake. I don't know what's happening. I think my helicopter's gone crazy. Wait, is it getting out? Melon, I might need more time. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, you got two minutes left, Sonny. Good luck. Wait, I'm almost out of this. Yes, we can stand up strong once again, helicopter. Just rise. Rise from the waterfall like a phoenix from the ashes. It's working? No way. We're free. Dude, I'm like a flying fish jumping out of that lake. Okay, so that was one cave system. I'm I'm just gonna ask the next question then. Are you in a natural cave system or like a secret bunker like the agency? I would say it's a natural cave system. Okay, that means you're probably up here somewhere. Wait, what is my helicopter doing? I just need to find a luscious green cave and spot a wee little melon in it. Yo, I mean, you don't have to. Did you hear my helicopter just now? Is that what's happening? No, I don't know what you're talking about. I feel like you're afraid, bro. You're afraid of my helicopter. I'm not afraid. I got no fears. Where is this stupid cave, dude? There's no caves here. I need more speed, more power. I'm out of questions. So there's nothing else I can ask. I'm just zooming around. I don't see any caves there. There's little tiny cracks, but that's not a cave. One minute left, Sonny. You gotta be kidding me. Are you really gonna try and tell me this is your cave? What? What is my cave? This little un 
underpass. What underpass? I'm looking for you, bro. Sonny, you is trash. You forgot about the biggest cave in the game. I'm going there right now. Chill out, dude. And I have lots of time. You have one minute. I actually have less. You have more like 30 seconds. Dude, you're literally capping on me. Why would you tell me you're over in the portal cave? Because I maybe I'm not in the portal cave. That's my point. You're capping. And then you're going to waste my timer. And then I'm going to lose. And maybe I'm in your head. And I want you to think that. So then I'm actually in the portal cave. So then I play mind games on you. But then maybe I'm saying this to show that I'm not. But maybe it goes even a layer more deep. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe a lot of things. But it's interesting that there's a big man melon green golf cart parked here. Uh -huh. You have 30 seconds left for real this time. Now, where is this melon? Is this a sleeping bag? Nope. Melon. I can smell that fertilizer, bro. Yo, there he is. No. I found you. Stay away. Stay away. Stay away. No. Hey, you're doomed. You're already doomed because you have a red torso. Bro, I couldn't change it. This game is so stupid. Let me change my torso. Nope. Instead, I will crush you. Chill. Yeah, that's right, bro. You did. Wait, what the heck happened to my character? Why do I look like this now? I look like an alien. Whoa, you do be looking kind of crazy, Melon. And I'm naked too. Where are my pants? What the heck? I'm all gold. Sonny, this is weird. Just go and hide. I don't want to see you right now. Okay, I'm just gonna do this really fast. Uh, yeah, that, that'll look better. There we go. I'm in my uniform now, okay? If you find me, I'm gonna have to put you under arrest. Wait, I don't want to be under arrest. Then just let me win. It's fine. All right, if I can't find you, it's because I let you win. All right, I'm okay with that. A win is a win. Okay, guys, for my hiding spot, I'm gonna go ahead and find myself the biggest house plot possible. Let's go over to the North Estate, and we're gonna spawn a mansion. Let's go. It's so beautiful. Look at all those lights. It's so shiny. Then I'm gonna open up the garage doors and go inside. Now I've got to choose my hiding spot super carefully. Okay, guys, now that I have my mansion spawned in, I am gonna do the craziest hiding round ever. I just gotta set the time to midnight, make it super creepy. My house is gonna be like a dark red color. Yo, that's weird. Then I need to set up my disguise. I'm gonna become a haunted ghost. A really scary one like the grudge with long hair and a creepy outfit. That looks pretty good. Yes, that's perfect. I need to become ghostly. Very spooky. Oh, maybe like this. Nah, definitely this. And I take the glasses off. Yo, that is so scary. Or should I just be like this? I'm dead. Man, I'm dead. Yeah, this is a little less scary. I'll start like that and then I'll turn on the really scary face after. Okay, now I just have to find a place to hide. Now, before I find my hiding spot, I'm gonna go to the disasters pack and turn on the ghosts. This is gonna make it so creepy and blackout. So it's even darker in my home. Yeah. Yo, I hope the ghosts are spawning. I don't see them yet. Yo, there she is. Oh, that's perfect. That is so creepy. Now I just have to go and find a really good hiding spot. I think right here like this. And then I just type this and my hiding spot is perfected. Melon is going to be so creeped out if he comes in here. Okay, bro. I'm ready. Oh, right, Sonny. First things first. I've got to fix my skin up. There we go. I'm back to normal. And wait, why is it dark out right now? What the heck is going on? Melon, it's currently 3 a.m. Bro, what the heck? Everyone knows the craziest, spookiest things happen at 3 a.m. They sure do, Melon. They sure do. I'm gonna just check the houses really quick, making sure you're not doing anything weird. Yo, you spawned in an estate and it's all white and spooky looking. What the heck, Sonny? Yeah, I don't know if I spawned this in or if the map is just haunted. Bro, oh, I don't like this. I'm gonna explore it. I hope you're not in that weird secrets box. I don't know how to really get in there. Press the button and open up the wall and stuff. This actually isn't so scary at all, Sonny. This is gonna be easy mode. It's not spooky. Yeah? You sure about that? Yeah, bro. What What's scary about this map, huh? Huh? I don't see anything spooky yet. Wait, what's that sound? Yeah! 
Ah! Ah! What the heck? Why is that doll there? What the heck, bro? Why does she keep flashing in and out? Be afraid. Be very afraid, Mr. Melon. This is too scary right now. Oh my god. She's levitating. What the heck? Bro! This is so spooky. Why are there so many weird player models? And now I go here, guys. I'm gonna keep jump scaring him. Ah! What the heck, bro? This is so creepy. Sonny, where are you? Guys, I am now the ghost of the toilet. Very stinky spooky. <laughs> All right, this one might blow my cover, but it's so worth it. Sonny, first question. Are you on the first, second, or third floor? I'm on the second floor. So, like, first floor is the basement, right? Wait, no, no. Basement is the basement. Oh, okay. So, you're upstairs. Yeah. Yo, this ghost is literally pooping. Wait a second. Sonny? Yeah? Second question. Are you this ghost? Wait, what the? You just reset your character. What are you talking about, bro? I wasn't a ghost. Bro, I literally just watched you reset your character. Wait, what the heck? Do you at spawn right now? No. <laughs> Yo, look at that melon run. Speed, 70. Yo, look at him. Look at him go. Where is this ghost? Wait, what the heck? You're up by your house right now. Wait, you can see it? You can see the ghost again? Watch out, it's haunted. Yo, get back here. I'm gonna run you over, ghost. You can't run ghosts over. Everybody knows that. They'll just go through the car. Nah, bro. You can. If you have a melon car, it can hit ghosts. Where did you go? True, ghosts' one real weakness is wander melons. It's true. Everyone knows that. But where the heck did you hide, Sonny? Are you back in your house? No, I'm not in my house. Are you down underneath this tunnel? No, you're not, bro. Where'd you go? Bro, I'm enjoying the pool. Oh, Sonny, I found you, bro. I know. Get over here. Get all out of here. I will scare you one last time. Get back here! Ah! That stupid doll. It scared both of us. You actually scared me. The doll scared me. It's way too creepy. I found you, Sonny. I win this game of hide and seek at 3 a.m. Yo! No, I just want to get out of this house. It's too haunted. Let's go! It's too creepy. Go dip, dip, dip. Quick, like and subscribe before that little Lake Madison ghost finds us. Today in Roblox Rainbow Friends, Friends, we unlocked a new secret challenge. If we can find all 10 Grimace milkshakes, we'll unlock the Grimace birthday party in Rainbow Friends. Basically, once we find all 10 shakes, we can drink the milkshake and then let Purple grab us. But Purple will actually become Grimace. Stick around until the end of this video to see what happens. Let's go. Uh, Melon, this looks like we landed in a new custom Rainbow Friends. We've got to find 10 Grimace shakes. Shakes. Bro, what the heck? Wait, do I see a little Grimace shake right here? Wait, I think I see a Grimace shake in the trash. Let's go. Nice. We've got one out of 10 already. Okay, Melon, we got to find nine more of these milkshakes and then we can drink it and go into Purple's lair for the top secret Easter egg. Let's do this thing. Come on, milkshakes. Where are you? Milkshake. Melon, let's split up and cover more ground. You check Rainbow Racers. I'm gonna see what's going on over here. All right, I'm checking Rainbow Racers and hopping in the Melon Mobile. Orange's Cavern Coaster. There's gotta be a milkshake here somewhere. Yo, I think there's one inside of this barrel. Come on. Yes, I got us the second milkshake. Nice, bro. I'm trying to find one on the Rainbow Racers track. I can't seem to see. Wait, there's one right here. Let's go. Yes. Nice find, bro. I'm inside of Blue's castle. I just know there's a milkshake here somewhere. Wait, I think I heard it. Yeah, I swear I heard a shake back here. It was in the employees only section, somewhere near the computers. Wait, is it in that corner? I think it is. Give me that shake. Give me that shake. Yes, I got it. Sonny, I'm heading into Purple's lair. There's for sure a milkshake in there. It is purple, but just be very careful because purple might transform into Grimace and kill you. It's okay. Oh, yes. Ah, ah. Ah, purple's after me. But I saw the Grimace shake. It was right on this ledge. Let me grab the shake. Yes, let's go. Oh, no, they're both after me. They're both after me. This is not good. This is not good. Dude, that's five shakes now. Awesome. Whoa, green. Chill. Actually, I should probably go back in Blue's castle. I never 
checked his chair. Uh, Sonny. There's a shake, Melon! Yeah, I know, I can see that. And I grabbed it because I'm the best. Oh, you're so annoying. We only got four more shakes left to go. Let me just avoid green and... Where would the other shakes be? Sonny, did you check under the waterfall? I didn't, bro. I'll leave that location for you. I'm gonna investigate closer to the Ferris wheel. Yo, there's a Grimace shake in here. Let's go! Seven shakes down. Only three to go. Come on. Maybe there's one in the bouncy castle. Hello? Milkshakes. Dang it! There's none in here. Sonny, did you check the top of the Ferris wheel? No. Sure, go and check it, bro. There's probably one up there. Uh, Melon, you're pretty stupid, bro. I don't see any milkshakes up here. Besides, how would a milkshake get way up on the Ferris wheel? Dude, I don't know. It's Grimace Shake, man. Anything can happen. True. Milkshakes from Grimace are pretty cursed. Speaking of, I see the milkshake! It's right here! I got it! Yo, let's go! Wait, do I see a Grimace Shake right in this thing? I think I do see a Grimace Shake. Blue, can you leave me alone? I'm trying to get this Grimace Shake. Let's... Oh, no, I can't fit! Let's go! I got the Grimace Shake! Nice work, bro! I've just been distracting Blue for you. And then I gotta come around, and I gotta take this zip line. What if the last shake is on the zip line? Use it! Yo, the shake! It's up here! I grabbed it! Let's go! Wait, what's gonna happen now, Sonny? I think we need to go to Purple's Lair and drink the milkshake. Let's go. I'm waiting for you at the top of the stairs. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm gonna go in my own way, Sonny. Bro, we should meet up and drink our shakes together. Ooh, Purple almost got me. <coughs> hey, Sonny. Hey, Melon. Let's drink the shakes. Yeah. Time to drink it, bro. <laughs> Mm, that was pretty good. Yeah. Wait, what's happening, Sonny? What's happening? Get to Purple's Lair, quick. We gotta see Grimace. We gotta see Grimace. I got eaten, Sonny. I'm hoping to get eaten by Grimace. Come on, come on. Yo! Ah! It's Grimace! Dude, the Grimace shakes actually worked. That was crazy, bruh. Whoa, bro, that was crazy. What other Easter eggs are next? Probably something for the skibbity bop toilets. You're probably right. This is Roblox Pick a Toilet. We have to guess which answer is the most popular in the game and then flush ourselves down a toilet. It feels like we're becoming skibbity toilet morphs and this was so much fun. And stinky. Hey, Melon, it's your favorite time. Uh, I don't know what time it is. Like, 2? 2 p.m. is a good time. No, it's time to pick a toilet. Yo, I actually get to pick a toilet? Yeah, buddy. Has your mom ever called your teacher by accident? Mm, has my mom ever <laughs> called your teacher mom? Yes, I have. I'm flushing myself. No way. You've actually called the teacher your mom? That's cringe, bro. Yes, I have, bro. I'm sure most people have. I've never done that. Flush me. It didn't work. It didn't work. Am I out? Am I free? Psych! It did work. You're dead. Dang it! Pennywise! No! I didn't mean it! Oh, no. He's making me float. He's making me float. Hey, at least from here I can see all the toilets. I'm dead. And you got plumbed, buddy. You got plumbed. I got plumbered? I got plumbed? Not like the fruit, sonny. You got plunged with a pooper. Dang it, whatever. I went through the correct toilet and now I've caught up to you. Which would you rather have? Gardens that grow donuts or chicken that lay chocolate eggs? Definitely chickens that lay chocolate eggs are you sure bro but donuts think about the donuts donuts i went to the chocolate egg dang it bro i thought for sure you'd want donuts donuts are like your thing wait what i went with you because you were correct last time you got us killed dang it i just died the most terrible death no don't mo don't run me i got run over by a tractor <sighs> Sonny, you're so stupid, bro. I knew it was the Garden of Donuts, but I didn't want to take your answer because I know how much you love donuts. I know, and I feel terrible for betraying them, but I just was trying to follow you. Come on, man. Come on, man. Yeah, I'm the leader. You're the follower. <sighs> Whatever, bro. Donuts are better, and we both know it. I do not even care what you say. Ah, I see what uh, you did there. Uh, uh, <laughs> you think you're funny, do you? Get down the blue slide! Wait, why are we going up? We're going up the blue slide, you idiot. Hey, whatever. What's the best way to eat macaroni and cheese? A fork or a spoon? Oh my god, 100% a fork, dude. You can't eat macaroni and cheese with a spoon. 
I don't know. It works good both ways. You're capping, bruh. I'm following you again, Melon. You better be right. Yeah, I'm always right. I aced it. Did you actually? Psych, you're dead. You're dead. Yes! Psych again. Double psych. You're actually alive. Thank you. We did it. Good work, brother. You find a spider in a beautifully woven web. What do you do? Uh, I let it be. Definitely leave it alone. Who wants to mess with spiders? That's dangerous. Yeah, just let it be, bro. Let it be. Let it be. Uh, oh, let it be. Dude, that's beautiful. Most people actually did let it be. Yeah. Best way to eat ice cream, Sonny. Cone. There's no, there's no argument. Yeah, 100%. It's gotta be a cone. If it's a cup, that's literally cap. Cup, cone, and cap. Keep it, keep it, keep it. Yes! On. Not even close, this vote. Yeah, dude. Not even close. Then we must climb the ladder to success. And then jump through this crack. And what would be better? Jello swimming pool or ice cream swimming pool? Easy, 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 easy. Yeah. That would be freezing cold! Jello would be way more comfortable. No, no, Sonny, you're silly. No, no, Homer, chill! Yes, victory! That was a pretty close vote. Dang it. I was correct. Bro, ice cream, I agree, would taste better. But think about how freezing cold that would be. Yeah, I'm not going in it. I'm just eating it, bro. What? what? Dude, of course you're going in it. It was a swimming pool. Not an eating what? pool. I, it's a lot of ice cream. I don't want to go in it, and then it gets all gross. And... Dude, you're telling me you don't want to eat ice cream after I've been swimming in it? Absolutely not, bro. It'd get all melted, and it would be disgusting. Plus, you carry gross bacteria. And on top of that, I love peeing in pools. It's kind of a pastime of mine. So disgusting, Sonny. What, bro? At least I don't poop in pools. Some people do that. Worst way to spend a full day. Palms covered in Cheeto dust, spinach. Oh my god, Cheeto dust. I can't imagine anything worse than that. Oh! Dude, imagine. You can't touch anything. You couldn't touch a thing. I'm actually gaming with Cheeto fingers right now. No, you're not. Yeah. You that, that would be gross, bro. You need a new That's keyboard. Me clicking my mouse and keyboard with my Cheeto dusty fingies. Ew! I feel like you're scraping that across your screen. That's disgusting. Yep, I am. You got a problem with that? I do, actually. I'm just never going to let you use my computer. The better drinking straw, paper or plastic? I'm sorry, turtles, but it's plastic! No, you must go with paper. Some of the new paper straws aren't actually that bad. Yeah, I'm sure, Sonny. I'm sure. It's true, like the bamboo paper ones are pretty good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. No, no! So many people! <laughs> you fool! They've abandoned the turtles! Not like this! Think about the ocean! Ah! They're gonna bowl at me! Don't do it. I don't want to be a part of this. I won't be a part of this. Oh, I died. Good riddance. I can't believe I have to go through a plastic straw. Sonny, purely hypothetically speaking here, if your brother accidentally sneezes on your ice cream, what do you do? Oh, I, uh, uh, five second rule? I'm throwing it out, bro. That's gross. Wait, if I sneezed on your ice cream, you wouldn't eat that. No, that's disgusting. How about you just wipe off the top layer? Yeah, I mean, I, if that was the option, maybe. Well, I went down the throw it out tunnel, and I think- Yes! I survived. Oh, well, Sonny, I just glitched out of the map. What? How? And now I'm just gonna beat the game. Oh, I'm here! I'm with you! Shortcut! And this is how you actually play this game. Wait. Arr! Which are you going backwards or forwards though? How do you know? Uh, I don't know. I'm just taking a while to guess here and I'm gonna reset my character because there's nowhere else to go. Well, that's good. I think I'm gonna glitch my way back inside. And yep, I'm back inside. Yo, it's the red slide tunnel. You must go through the red playground. You see a celebrity in the public restroom. What do you do? Ask for an autograph or give them privacy? Privacy, bro. I go into their stall and ask for an autograph. Dude, don't be weird. You just wait outside the restroom and bombard them the second they get out. No, I go in the stall with them, sit on their lap, and then ask for an autograph. Dude, dude, just stop. I don't want to hear from you ever again. What? Hey, we swirled through the first 10 levels. We're doing great. Oh, no. Sonny, I'm getting cannonballed, but he can't hit me because I'm too good at juking. Well, you're going to die anyway. Are you sure about that? I just flushed myself to the next dimension. Whoa, look at this place. Bro, there's gotta be some awesome new questions somewhere here. Here it is, got it. Oh, we've leveled up. There's three toilets now. It's getting harder, Melon. 
Mm. I'm on my way. Just wait for me, Zenny. I am waiting for you. Let me just ask you the question so you have some time to think about it. Which animal would you want to switch places with for a day? A cat, a bird, or a monkey? Uh, bird. Yeah, I'm pretty sure bird's gonna win. Ooh, I found the ultimate toilet. You think so, Mr. Melon? Please tell me bird wins. Dude, are you kidding me? How is it monkey? Dude, that makes no sense. A monkey is the thing we're closest related to. It wouldn't be that much different from our current experience. I guess people just want to be like themselves. I'm going down, bird. Nice try, buddy. Dang it. Why didn't you pick monkey? Because that makes no sense, dude. Obviously, everyone's going to want to be a bird. Dang it. I thought people would want to be a watermelon. I'm already a watermelon. Yeah, but other people. Worst thing to get stuck to your shoe in a public restroom. Bubblegum, band-aid, or wet toilet paper. Gross, gross, and gross. Uh, gum. Gum is the worst. That's tough, bro. Gum has got to be the worst. It's so hard to get off. Are you kidding me? What did these people vote for? Poopy, stinky poop. Ah, la, 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 la. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, no. I got farted on. And died. Okay, I kind of believe you there. I'm going to go with a wet toilet paper. No, no, it's going to be the Band-Aid. People are scared of Band-Aids. Oh my god, it was the Band-Aid. No, you're capping. You're you're an absolute actor. Or am I double capping? <laughs> Is he double capping? I actually don't know. Yo, it was wet toilet paper. What the heck? You're a terrible actor. I could sense it from a mile away. What is the best way to spend a snow day? Snowball fight. Building a snowman. Sledding. It's sledding. That's my that's my vote. I would totally sled. Dang it, it was building a snowman. You're cap. You're actually cap. Are you sure? It was sledding. And Homer Simpson is definitely not in front of me, forcing me to eat donuts. Yo, chill! He killed me with the power of donuts. Actually, what's the best way to eat pizza? Folded like taco, knife and fork, or rolled like a burrito? You're actually getting ahead of me! Come on! Bro, rolled like a burrito? Who rolls their pizza up like a burrito? It's gotta be the taco option. Wait a second. Do you want to try that? Do you want to get pizza tomorrow and roll it up like a burrito? Ooh, that sounds bussin'. It could be really good, actually. Bussin', bussin'. For real, for real. It's like a calzone, but it's a burrito. And it's low cals. I don't think it'll be low calories. You don't know that. All right, taco time. No, it's not taco. Oh, no, it's uh, taco. Dude, it's obviously taco. It's not knife and fork, and it's definitely not burrito. All right, all right. Best options to dry your hands in a public restroom. Cloth towel roller. I have never seen one of those in my whole life. Wait for me. Paper towel or a hot air dryer. I'm going hot air dryer. See ya. Let me help you. I'm almost there. Dang it. It wasn't hot air dryer. It, was it clearly the, was. The you're thing. doing a hot air dryer sound effect. No, what are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, bro, the cloth towel rollers, I have seen them. They're terrible. They're gross. Does everyone use the same cloth towel? Well, it kind of has like a bunch of them and then it eventually ends, I guess. But it just feels gross. You know what I mean? Even though it's the most environmentally friendly. Actually, no, the hot air is probably more friendly. You're right. If you could only eat one food for the rest of your life, what would it be? Wait. Melon, slow down. Did you use hot air dryer? Which one did you go with? Probably taco. Yo, shush and answer me. Did you go hot air dryer or are you lying? I went hot air dryer. Are you capping? I don't know. You're probably capping. Oh, I'm going down. I'm going scuba diving in the hot air dryer. Uh-oh, I got eliminated by the taco. Yes, I can actually catch up to you finally. No, no, why is this toilet throwing toilet paper? I'm dead. Perfect. Now then, if you could only eat the food for the rest of your life, which food would it be? Sonny. It's gotta be pizza. Sonny, don't go down. Sonny, look what they did to me. What happened to you, Melon? Look what they did to me. What happened? You've transformed. You've got to be very careful, Sonny. It's pizza. Yeah, I, I believe you actually entirely. Oh my God, it's ice cream. No, it's not. You're so capped. That was the most obvious vote of the day. Get that toilet paper roll off your head. You're disgusting. I can't. Bro, you are filthy. Clean yourself up. Now, where's the next question? It's got to be right here. Perfect. If you could have any vehicle, Melon, what would it be? A sports car, a private jet, or a giant robot? Uh... Please tell me it's the robot. Please. What the heck, man? It's not robot. Dude, that's such cap. It's not robot. All right, then how are you dying? Uh, there's a giant tunnel, it's dark, and an alligator is coming to eat me. No, I'm dead. What did you pick? Mmm, that feels like cap, Sonny. 
What are you gonna pick then, Mr. Melon, if I'm capping? I'm gonna go giant robot. You're right. It wasn't an alligator. It was in fact a crocodile. No! Oh, I did die. Are you kidding me? Maybe they picked that jet. They're trying to go crazy. I'm about to get rolled. I'm about to get rolled by a bowling bowl. And I'm dead. I just can't believe it wasn't giant robot. Like, seriously? That's the coolest one ever. <sighs> Well, it's gotta be Private Gia. It's not. I'm not even capping. I went down the sports car and it worked. How are you dying? I'm not dying. It worked. That's my point. Mm, I feel like that's camp. Favorite type of soap in a public restroom? Liquid soap, bar soap, or foaming soap? Hope you didn't lie. Please tell me you didn't lie to me. Oh, I lied to you. Absolutely. Oh my god! <laughs> did you actually go into the sports car? No, I didn't do that. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes, you did. You totally did. Sonny, did you know the best ideas are born in the bathroom? I'm not surprised, because every time I go take a big ol' poop, I have some moments of pure genius. Genius is a stretch, Sonny. I know how you discovered you were a watermelon. You had a bad case of the runs. I only run from the police, Sonny. Okay, sure, buddy. Favorite type of soap? Liquid, bar, or foaming? I, I honestly, foaming is the goaded soap. Please tell me I was correct. Oh, come on! Why? Oh my god, what did I just fall into? What are you doing, bro? What did I just fall into? What are you doing? No, I can't get out! Oh my god, bro. Yo, these people have toilet papers on their head and a giant poop on them. Sonny, I'm s this is so stupid. Why am I stuck? Why? Why? Why can't I get out of here? Try resetting your character, you dummy. This is so stupid. Melon, hurry up. I'll wait for you at this question. Oh, so it was foaming soap, you capper. <laughs> oh, I thought I got you with that one. No, I got stuck in a freaking, freaking thing. Anyways, I'm here now, Sonny. Where are you? I moved on quite a bit. I'm quite far ahead oh. of you now. Oh my god, I'm down a tunnel. Oh my god. Hey, Melon, look behind you. <laughs> Yo! You can't be doing that, bro. Easiest, scariest one of all of these is 100% the centipede. You think so? Imagine if you had a silverfish, though. Gross. We ain't playing Minecraft, Sonny. This is Roblox. You're right. I take the centipede because it's got a lot more legs. It's actually got 100 legs. Did you know that? Oh, dang it. It was the centipede. And now we get to the next level of toilets. What's the best way to spend a rainy day? With friends. Watching movies. Nope. Board games. Dude, you really think you're going to play board games? I'm voting what I like best, and it's board games. Oh my god, Omer Simpson is farting in my face. I know that you're lying. How do you know I'm lying? Because I'm the one getting a diarrhea toilet about to murder me. No, no, it's farting and throwing toilet paper at me. That was cruel. Yeah, now I have toilet paper on my head. That's embarrassing. Oh, bro, I got tooted on so hard. No way, you won. Let's go! That doesn't even make sense. I am the goat. You are so trash. I escaped first. And you owe me a million Robux. That was the rules. No, 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 no. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. And go down this toilet. And come on. Flush, flush, flush. Uh, we only bet one Robux on this anyways. Nice try. And first is the worst. Second is the best. And I'm rebirthing myself. See you. Yeah, I'm right behind you, brother. That was awesome and if you guys think that was awesome you should totally like and subscribe in this video sunny and i escaped from mr yummy and he's trying to put us in his dummy in order to escape we have to dodge his deadly groceries and you know what else would be deadly if we could hit 3,000 likes on this video press it right now yo melon we're here in mr yummy's grocery store obby we've got to get out of here bro let's run dude he looks way too creepy dude you don't even see him right now Ah! Quick, let's get out of the crazy supermarket. I got jump scared by that cutscene. Yo, you need to chill. I'm trying to check in with the staff to see what they're up to. First boy here is like, I want to go home. I'm shad. Uh, and then the second guy's, I'm so bored. 
The manager is mad. I'm hungry. Yo, they don't even let them get a lunch break. These dudes are starving. Whatever, Melon. Let's get out of this obby. Get me out of this cutscene, bro. Your hairdo looking whack. Yo, make sure you don't jump on the sand. The sand in the grocery store. Yeah, who spilled the sand? I thought this was gonna be milk. We're literally in the milk carton section. But it's got this nasty texture. You're right, bro. That's a dirty milk. Wait, melon? Don't tell me this is skim milk. What? What's so bad about skim milk? Dude, that's nasty. Get me out of here. Pop the mustard. Get over the ketchup. Up the boxes in the vents. It's a real obby, bro. They got vents. Dude, I think I just saw purple in there. Purple kind of chill though in this obby. He was okay with it. Yo, purple rainbow friend in the vents. I love that boy. Yo, look at him, dude. He's so fat and weird. Yeah, what the heck? He looks like he's grew from minions. Oh my god, he's he doesn't have a nose. Oh my god, he's right next to me. He's trying to grab me, bro. He's so weird. He just fell over. Yo, I'm gonna jump on him. <laughs> look at this boy right here. Yo, what up, G? Hold up, chicken melon. I'm gonna dance on his head oh Sorry, don't don't touch that don't touch the water yo i'm shaking my butt in his face let's go yo that revive animation was crazy melon don't step in the water bro it's so slippery it'll kill you now let's get up here all right it slid my atoms apart and killed me instantly yo those melon seeds never stood a chance you were too juicy with it yo i feel like i've seen this map before i think you're imagining that melon this level is brand new yo there's a sale at the shop what should i buy today guys no sunny don't bazooka i hate these bazookas they're all always so trash and just kill me instead of melon what else do we have here i gotta fake distance before sunny kills me no the epic dragon pet have a cute dragon follow you around and occasionally it'll breathe fire i'm gonna buy this thing i hope it burns melon up give me this give me this give me this yo chill I don't got no cheer, bro. I got a dragon, though. And it's gonna burn you if I get close. It's a good thing you're never getting close, Sonny. I'm speed running. That's what you think. I'm already across the chocolate bars. Yo, look at these baguettes. This bread. Oh, my gosh. The donuts. Melon, get back here. Did you see these donuts? I didn't see them donuts, though. Bro, they looking good. I kind of got to take a break here and eat some of these, okay? They're gone. Look at your dragon. He can't do anything, bro. He's such a little wimp. Yo, call the dragon and whip again. It's burning you. Oh my god. Oh no, it burnt me, Sonny. <laughs> You wasted your Robux. Guys, I hate this melon. I'm buying a bazooka. This is what he gets. Okay, what am I supposed to do here? Dodge the milk? I'm almost there, melon. Where'd you go? Don't you worry about it, Sonny. I just passed the french fries. Yo, wait for me. How did hey, you- Hey, I'm in the jungle gym. The french fries are deadly. I tried to jump on them. That was a mistake. Yo, turn me into a ghost. You're right. That's spooky. <gasps> Make it, make it, and then... No, chill! I'm in the jungle gym. Chill, Melon. I don't have anything. Boom! No, you killed yourself, too. Worth it. So worth it. That's what you get for making fun of my little dragon pet. Boom! Stop, you're destroying both of us. Yo, I kind of look like a pancake. Yo, I gotta move quickly before he bazookas me again. I'm not gonna bazooka you. I'm just gonna beat the game because I'm the goat. Wait, does this even hurt you? No, it doesn't. I just ran right over it. Yo, are these M&Ms or Skittles? All I know is they look tasty. No, gotta keep on running. He's gonna bazooka me. I'm going to bazooka blast you. No, don't bazooka blast me. I have no choice. Yo, you can just run everywhere in this jungle gym. Nothing hurts you. Let's go. Sonny, you're so slow. I was just testing some theories. Some theories. Oh, yes. Now I go down the slide and escape into the ball pit. Yeah, get in that ball pit, bro. Get those balls. Get those balls. And that kills me. Yo, I'm in. Where's Melon? Where's Melon? <gasps> we didn't even need to go in the jungle gym. No, wait, what? Could have just walked right over here. Oh, wait, no, there's an invisible. Oh, my God. Dude, stop trying to cheat the map. Play legit. Fine, I'll play legit, Sean. Jump on the gumballs, get across, and boom! No! I died right at the door! Melon, watch out! They got mushrooms and lettuce and tomatoes. I know you don't like vegetables. 
Sonny, you gotta stop blasting me. You only like fruits. I got your back, bro. Don't worry. I gotta make distance. Dude, look at these bananas. They're throwing themselves at the wall. What is this? They don't want to work here anymore, Sonny. They'd rather take themselves out. You oh, no. Why'd you shoot yourself? You're so dumb. Mistakes were made. Uh, I regret nothing. I got sniped by a banana. Oh, wait. These are deadly? Yo, check out these pineapples. Ooh, lives in a pineapple. I don't know, see. Fine, five square pants. Oh, wait. They don't even throw pineapples. Let's go through the bookstore. Wait. Who puts books in a grocery store, yo? Get rid of that. I do. Because I'm always learning. Always expanding my brain. Yeah. My what are you going to learn about this lesson? No, you're going to... Yo, I didn't even die. You just shot yourself. Bro, why do I keep pancaking? Let's go. Beat the library. And I use Sonny's own weapons against him. Now, what the heck is that? I want all the victory points. You're going to do the same thing as me. I know you're going to do the same thing as me. Did I go the wrong way? No, bro. You got to do this parkour. No, I shouldn't have said anything. Yeah, learn this lesson. And you're dead, too. Good job. Ooh. Worth it. Totally worth it. And now I can climb in peace. Wait, why am I dead? I came back to life dead. Wait, what? Oh, that sucks, bro. Now I take the lead. Chill. Wait, how are these planks holding themselves up? What the... Uh, we made it. I got to get past the hamburger. Watch out for the french fries. They got that crinkle cut. They're dangerous. Yo, that's a lot of burger sauce. Look at how much sauce they spilled. A lot of sauce. Too much sauce. You got too much sauce. You got too much... Oh my gosh, that's why I hate these bazookas. <laughs> you exploded yourself, didn't you? It's garbage. Take it back. I want a return. Give me my Robux back. This thing don't work. I'm escaping through the storage room, so... Sunny. Wait for me, Melon. I'm still stomping this on some t-shirts. This is so cool and you're missing out, dude. Oh my god. What is that, bro? That's Adam Levine. You just missed Adam Levine. He was Chill. here. Chill. Wait, what the heck, bro? What do I do? I step on the shirts, I die. I step on the background of the shirts, and I die. Where am I supposed to go? One, two. Okay, maybe I just got unlucky? I don't get this. Hey, dude. Yes, I made it. Skip that dialogue. Nobody cared. Ooh. Oh, I'm dead. Man, I'm dead. I'm dead. Hold on, let me change my clothing. Let me get snazzy with it. It ain't giving me the clothes. Whatever, I'm out of here. Hey, Sonny. Hey, Malone. Bro, this is actually sick. There's a secret vent that you go through to enter the secret room. I am in the secret. Wait, I can't go in the secret. What? How did you go in the secret vent? By running through the secret vent. Oh, you're right. Okay. <laughs> I did it. Yeah, I'm the goat. Here you go, Melon. No! Finally, it worked! Justice! Ow. Well, that sucked. What the heck? I didn't even touch it. Full speed ahead. Let's go, let's go. These fans are in slow motion, bro. This vent is trash. Bro, it's harder than you think. Yo, wait. Why is there an alien in this vent? What is this boy? Yo, this is another shop. Buy a map of the maze. No thanks. I could beat this myself. Yeah, why would I need a map when there's literally an arrow telling me what to do? I take a left. Oh, and I go straight. Look for the next side. Then I take a right. Bro, this is so hard. Oh, yeah, that's the maze. Completed. Easy game. I took the wrong turn. Because you trash, bro. You trash. I'm lost. I'm lost, Sonny. I'm at the next cutscene. Look at this dude with a mop and that funky hairdo. I need a map. How many doors are closed? We're going to have to go through the meat freezer. Dang, those T-bones looking juicy. Wait, maybe those are giant turkey legs. I kind of want to bite at that. I found the arrow. I'm, I'm getting out of the maze. Finally. Yo, guys, the second melon steps out of this vent, I'm going to to blast them. Boom! Nice, buddy. Good job, buddy. Why is this rocket launcher so bad? Gotta go through this meat locker before Sonny blasts me. I'm not gonna blast you anymore. I'm so done with that. Yo, wait, what's under these? Oh, it's just the bone. I thought these were buttons I could press. Nah, dude. It's just normal ham meat. Uh, these look like turkey legs. I'm gonna pretend it's turkey. You can keep your ham, all right? I prefer turkey. Comment down below. What's tastier, ham or turkey? Turkey. I mean ham. I mean turkey. I mean ham. Watermelon. Everyone knows watermelons are the best food. You smash them, you make smoothies, and you eat that. Don't eat watermelons, guys. They're not good for you. They'll actually kill you. They'll eat you from the inside. Bro, that's weird. Just don't eat watermelons. Trust me. Get back here, melon. Chill. I'm almost caught up to you. Uh, you ain't caught up, bro. I'm on the way. Enter the forklift. Yeah, you want to do that? I'm going to go talk to my dude over here. That was the wrong way. Do you know the way? And boom, through the the exit. Oh, okay. Let's go. We're doing it big. Did we just escape? I hope so. Wait, no. We get speed cola. We gotta go super fast, Sonny, and dodge the cars. It's gonna be so difficult. Quick, run away to safety. 
I don't want to get caught by Mr. Yummy. Slurp that up. And now I go super speed. Wait for me. Wait. Yo. Chill. That was easy. Hands up. Get down. I just wanted more customers. Oh, look. He's so sad. I actually kind of feel bad for him. He's not even that mean. He was pretty friendly. Like, he tried to chase us. He was probably just trying to give us some free groceries. And then he got captured by the police. He didn't even deserve that. He's pretty ugly, though, so he kind of deserved it. Bro, we talking about? He got those big arms. He hits the gym. Look how huge he is. Dude, his <laughs> arms are longer than his entire body. Yeah, because he's strong with it. Yo, check it out, Sonny. My face is different. I have no eyes. Where'd they go, bro? Yo, check me out. I am going to turn in to the ugliest thing of all time. I'm a melon. Wait, why do I have a blue head? Why are you blue? Why is your head so shiny, bro? Yeah. You bald. No, no, no. Those are my melon seeds. Don't you see them in there? Wait, you don't even have that many, dude. You're a phony. You're a phony. What are you talking about that many? You only have four, bro. I have more than you. No, I have like at least 200 melon seeds inside me. Whatever, dude. I'm so done with you. And if you guys are also done with melon, click the like and subscribe button. Let's get at least 212 new subscribers. So one of our viewers left a comment saying we should play a game called The True Ingredient. Ingredients. I downloaded it and this thing looks freaky, brothers. It's basically cursed SpongeBob at 3 a.m. So let's play. Sonny, what is this? Bro, we're about to find out. Oh my god, Patrick. Bro, he looks like a demigorgon who downloaded Stranger Things. It was a normal day in Underwear Zip City. You were hungry and wanted a human patty. So you decided to go to the Crunchy Cans restaurant. Bro, what is up with Squidward? He doesn't even have a nose. What is this? <laughs> oh God, wait, what? Am I so hideous? I thought I was beautiful. It's so cursed. I guess we got to place an order. Squidward's nose is gone. It's like they yanked it off and made him really realistic. Welcome to the Crunchy Cans restaurant. What can I get you? First the worst, second the best. Yeah, we'll go number two. I would like a human patty, please. Creepy Squidward. Find the seat. I'll get you when it's ready. Oh God, what is Patrick doing? I'm gonna pretend he's not there. Yeah, I think the fish just drowned. Buddy, you good? Is that blood or, or sauce? Oh, he's sleeping in ketchup. Yeah, that definitely seems like fun, brother. Is my human patty ready? It's almost done, but we ran out of patties, so I might take longer. Is there any way to speed that up, dude? You can go to the warehouse and get some patties. Be careful, it's dark down there. And whatever you do, do not go in the room at the end of the corridor. Uh, Melon, this is looking mad sus. Bro, let's go to the room at the end of the corridor. Yeah, let's do it right away, honestly, I agree. Oh boy, why is this at the bottom? of the Crunchy Cans restaurant. What kind of mysteries lie below, bro? I'm sweating. My palms are greasy. Uh, uh, what was that? I think that was Sir Krabs. Not Mr. Krabs. Not to be confused with him. Okay, we found the patties. Why do they look so disgusting? Bro, you know what it looks like? You know those cheese things? Oh, no. It's the cheese with the wax on top that you gotta peel back. Yeah. Baby bells. A whole crate of them. They're probably mad moldy, too. Can I grab the crowbar? I'll feel a lot safer if I had a bloodied up crowbar. Uh-oh. Well, that's how they flip the patties. That must be the ketchup room. Lots of sauce coming out of there. Melon, it's a skull and bones. Nothing could go wrong, right? Dude, that's literally like the universal sign for safety. I'd go in. Wait, let me open that up. We call. Whoa! Oh my god! Whoa! Maybe I was wrong about that safety thing. I think he was just warning us. That's why he sent us backwards. He's like, yeah, don't come here. It's kind of toxic. There's asbestos and carbon monoxide leaks. Yeah, I think he was just looking out for our safety, really. Yeah, I think he's also lactose. He probably didn't like the baby bells. True, he didn't want this waxy cheese coming down there. All right, I'm bringing the patty up, though. Hey, Patrick. That is slightly concerning. What if he breaks in? I don't think there's enough human patties to quench his hunger. Patrick's a vegetarian, look. You think? Starfishes, uh, I think, don't eat meat. I don't want to stick around to find out. Hurry up, Squidward. Oh, you actually managed to get a patty from the cursed warehouse. Good job. Now go inside the kitchen and put it on the grill. He's making you cook? Aren't you the customer? This place sucks. The kitchen is the first door on the right side. Bro, I've got to make my own meal? Dude, I really thought SpongeBob was going to jump scare us here, but we're safe. We're cool. We're cool. We're cool. Oh, yeah, that's nice. That is giving off just the best smell. Love a good human patty. <sighs> ah, good stuff. All right, we need a bun. Let me grab that. 
All right, I gotta get my uh, human patty. I Uber Eats. Pause the game. Bro, they got delivery for this restaurant now? Nice. Yeah. All right, let me just bun up my burger. I don't want it to get too soggy. All right, I got my human patty. Dude, let me know how juicy it is, all right? I've always wanted to try one. <laughs> this is a great game to eat, too. Do I have to sit down to eat this thing? I just want to demolish it right now. I'm too eager. Ask Patrick. He might know how to how to eat something. Yo, patty boy, I got a burger for you. You hungry? No, you don't want it. You're right. He's a vegetarian. Uh, melon, the fish is gone. And there's a lot more ketchup. Um, maybe dip it in the ketchup. It might uh, help. True. There might, there might be some good flavor to be added in here. Let me get some of this sauce. Juice that burger in the sauce. I think you have to investigate this. Yeah, let me get some floor sauce. You're right. Why is there ketchup all over the floor? Someone should clean this up. Yeah, I'm trying to mop it up with my burger bun right now. Yo, Squidward, you got a mess back here, dude. Sit down and enjoy your human pie. Yes, Squidward. I will obey your orders. I am sitting. I am also eating. Bro, that must have been gas. That was a delicious and juicy burger. Mmm, that human patty tasted like my grandma's toenails. I just love eating granny's toenails, you know what I'm saying? She got the best toenails. Yeah, she got that fire, you know what I'm saying? She got that extra fungus on it. Mm, is it good? That would be $78.99, please. What? I said that would be $87.99. Bro, his prices just went up again. Dude, chill. Why the hell is this so expensive? Listen, buddy, I know there's a mistake. I ordered a simple human patty and you made me cook it myself. You should be paying me right now. I said that would be $98.99, please. Bro, he's starting to get angry. I don't know about this. Chill, chill, chill. I don't got $100 in my pocket right now. I'm broke. I got 35 bills only. So you're saying you don't have the money for the human patty with you? No, I mean, yes, I have enough money, but it's at home, Squiddy. I can go and get it for you if you just move Patrick uh, away from the door. I'll, I'll get the money. So you're saying you don't have the money for the human patty with you right now? I don't have $100 on me. You think I got Benjamins on me like that? Oh, no, the music's changing. That's not good. Oh, God. <laughs> no, 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 no. Mr. Krabs. <laughs> Melon, I don't like this. Those burgers were not competitively priced. Wait a second. Bro, Plankton needs to be executed. Holy crap, look at that dude. We need to put Plankton in a vat of grease and never look back. This is horrifying, dude. Oh God, are you okay? And why are you in this cage? I was trying to steal the secret formula, but I failed and Mr. Crab put me in this cage. How did you get stuck in this room? Did you try to steal the secret formula? No, dude, the human patty was mad expensive. I didn't have enough money to pay it back. I know, Mr. Crab is an... Really nice guy. I'll try to save you from this cage then. Reluctantly, I really don't want to. Don't really try. Mr. Crab has locked me in the cage and swallowed the key, but good luck anyway. Okay, good. Then I don't have to save you. Fair play. Oof, thank goodness. We'll leave him in there. I won't mess with Mr. Krabs. We've got a secret code we've got to figure out. Three fishes. Three fish, three fish, okay. There's one starfish in the room. Oh yeah, on the wall, you're right. Check for more, dude. Uh, that's a lot of sauce. The sauce is leaking in. Not the ketchup. Okay, one starfish. Two starfish. I think two. Okay. Wait, what's back here? Another box? Four boxes? Or is it five boxes? One is hidden. Oh. Two buns? Two balls. Okay. Melon, what is the password? Three fish. Two starfish. Yes. Four boxes. I got this. And two balls. We're gonna do it right. Try five boxes, maybe? Five head. Hey! Rolling out. I have to save the green guy first. We have to find a key. I think we have to kill Mr. Crab. Mr. Crab swallowed it. Or maybe he pooped it out. Please, let me grab the crowbar. Yes. All right, let's get the green guy out. Just crowbar it open. And then we can smack him after. We'll get you out of here. Oh, God, look at his nose. Oh, my God. What is wrong with him? Thank you for saving me. Let's go and find the way out of this place. Come on, Pickle Rick. Let's get out of here. I have a feeling he might not make it. <laughs> It's safe, I promise. I have to put the tool back. This is my weapon. You want me to put it back? He's a good guy, you know? He would never steal the secret recipe. He would never smash Mr. Krabs with a crowbar. Come on, Plankton. After you. No, no, I insist. No, for real, go. No, no, pickles first. All right, fine. Oh, no. I don't want to do this, Melon. Bro, we have to. We have no choice. The secret vault. The secret formula. The formula is all ours. This is another keypad for the safe. I should find a passcode. Open up. Time to become a hacker. Stoop on the computes. Bro, this is an old computes. I'm not so sure anymore. There's a folder with all passwords. Bro, it's got 144 FPS. That's all I'm saying. True. This thing goes quick with it. I gotta get Rick rolled real quick. Copyright. Block that out. Oh God, I forgot he was here. We have to suffer through the Rick roll for the password. 5089. Don't forget it, Melon. The code is 6969. What? Did you forget it? Fine. 6969. Oh. 
Five zero seven two. No, no, it's four two zero six nine, dude. Oh, wait. Let me try. We're in. Oh my, Krabs is not gonna be happy about this. The secret oh formula. God. Oh my gosh. What is wrong with him? Oh no. <laughs> He's dead for sure. Oh! oh no! He's gone! At least he's gone! Oh my god! What is that? Sponge! Big man Sponge is coming after you. We gotta run from the beast. I hope we can go outside into the ocean and let him suck up all the water. Then he'll be too slow to move. Come on. Run, Sonny! I'm so afraid! Don't be afraid of death. Oh my god! Wait, where are you supposed to go? It opened up this door now, I think. I'm going, I'm going. Turn around. Oh my god! Ah, he's hideous! Oh, I can sprint! I wasn't sprinting this whole time! I was walking away from this monster slowly! Uh, uh. Bro, where are you supposed to go? Dude, we're stuck in this maze! What's the code? What's the code? Grek is Grek. What? Run, run! What is Grek? Grek is Shrek? Maybe this is some meme we don't know about. Study the memes, quick, Melon! Get your research on! I don't know, just try Grek! Let me interact! I gotta move. I can't stay still. Wait, run around and look for a passcode. That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. Maybe we needed to do more research on the computer. We Rick rolled ourselves. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Did we make it? Hey, we meat grinded ourselves. Nice. Hey. Ooh. I know the code. Hurry up, Sonny. I'm trying. We got him! Yo! Grek is love! Grek is life! Wait, Shrek? Come on, Shrek. Boy. He is beautiful. Oh, SpongeBob got the Western pistol ready on the hip. Oh my god. Melon, this is the weirdest thing we've ever done. I don't know what we're doing right now. Oh, look how porous he is. Standoff of the century. SpongeBob or Greg? Or us in the back, though. I got the fish. Dude, we look scuffed. <laughs> you. Oh, Shrek taking the hit. I think he dodged it. Bro. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Greg goes different out here. Spongebob. Oh, I guess we all died. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, that was great. I like and subscribe. It's late at night and we decided to try calling Amanda the Adventurer. So we FaceTimed her at 3 a.m. and tried to get screenshots of her before she could jump scare us. And then we sent text messages trying to learn Amanda's secret hiding spot where she's put Wooly. Can we get 2,003 likes? And if you're new to our channel, subscribe in the next two seconds to get an apple. One, two, let's go! M -m melon this is gonna be so creepy it's three in the morning and we're gonna be calling amanda yo what up amanda yo chill melon don't be so excited she's gonna be creepy no she's chill bro trust me uh-oh she answered oh. oh okay amanda ain't chill sonny amanda ain't chill oh i captured her in 4k what is she doing bro i took one photo of her so far uh-oh uh sonny just realized amanda's not the one you want to facetime she can go through the phone you're right bro and she's so weird She's probably recording us for her next secret tape. Yo, her head just turned around. Uh, is she gonna say anything or just be really creepy? I think she's probably just gonna be creepy. Tell me when I should take more photos. I could do four more. One right now. Oh, got her. Uh, she was probably not the happiest camper. Oh, that scared me. Why is she so weird, bro? Dude, I'm waving back. Hi, Amanda. I took a photo of her just in case we need to remember it. Ah! Photo! Get away! That was uh, an abrupt ending to a phone call. That was too scary, Sonny. Let's just get on text with her. Okay. Uh, what should I say? Hi, Amanda. Is she ghosting us? Hello? I don't think she's happy with us, Sonny. You there? Oh, she's there. Oh, she's texting. Can you spell 
grave. Dude, that's weird. G-R-A-V-E. G-R-A-V-E. I, I put spaces. <laughs> Is it right? That's so wrong. What do you mean? Sonny, try it. Spell it properly. Hold on. I'm telling her she's wrong. Whoa, chill, Sonny. Great job. <laughs> now we can make an apple pie. You're awesome. <laughs> Yo. Do you think she's going to be happy with us? I hope so. Hey, I love apples. Do you like them too? Say no. Say no. <laughs> no. Apples suck. We only like melons. Hey, we don't eat melons, though. We just like them. Wrong word. Try again. Can you say apple? Bro, should we say apple? Apple. Apple. Comment down below apple emojis. I want to see hundreds of apple emojis. Apple. I hope she doesn't freak out. Yo, she really wants to make some apple pie. Okay, let's do it. What's she gonna say? Nope, not there. Try again. Where's the butcher? Dude, Amanda is tweaking. She's weird, dude. Uh, I don't know. But where's Wooly? I wonder what she's doing to Wooly, bro. She's baking apple pies and talking about the butcher. Uh-oh. At the door. Okay. Knock, knock. Uh-oh. Dude, this is weird. Tell the meat man what we need. I don't know. We just need apples. This is creepy, Sonny. I don't really like this conversation. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Can you spell dead, Sonny? Can you? Dead. Please tell me Wooly's not dead. Please don't be Wooly. Type out. I'm right behind you. Melon, I don't think... I should do this. Uh... This is getting scary. Should I submit it? Do I press the button? I think you have to, Sonny. Our phone's almost out of battery life, too. What if I send this text and she jump scares us? No, you'll be okay, Sonny. Send it. It's the only way to get her to leave. I sent it. What the heck? What is this? She's holding Wooly. Uh. What is happening? What is going on? Where's the store? Put Wooly down. This is so weird, Melon. This is so weird. No. Oh. I don't like Amanda right now. I don't want to talk about apples anymore. Dude. <laughs> What is that? What is that, Sonny? That's so cursed. That's Wooly. I think he's in the butcher shop. Oh, no. Don't hurt Wooly. Don't hurt him. Please, don't be Wooly. Finally at the door. Knock and see what happens. Okay. I'm scared. Tell the meat man what we need. Meat? Yeah, meat? <laughs> Yo, you were right. Hey, we did it, Sonny. Fine. Be quiet. She typed be quiet in all caps. That's a bit weird. What the heck? Uh, what do we need from the meat man then? Wooly? Apple. I didn't know the meat man sold apples. Sorry. He sells everything nowadays. I hope Wooly is safe because she asked where Wooly is. Bro, Amanda has lost the plot. I think the meat man needs everyone to like and subscribe. Do it now. If you want apples, meat, Wooly. What's she going to do now, huh? Uh-oh. What the heck? She sent a photo of Wooly. You are weird. No cap. I'm out, Amanda. You creepy. <laughs> Melon, I have another idea. Let's call Big Jumbo Josher. Yo, what up, Big Joe? Is he gonna answer? It is three in the morning. Yo, he picked up. Uh, Sonny? Yeah? Why is Jumbo Josh look so small? I don't know. Where'd he go? He has uh, definitely punched somebody, though, Melon. He had a bit of red on his hand. Oh. Uh... Why is he lurking behind the tree? Uh, I don't know, Sonny. He's getting a little closer. I'll take a photo for good, uh, for good measure, just to be safe. The music's getting creepy. Oh, he's gone. We're fine. We're totally fine. We chilling. <laughs> we chilling. I hope he doesn't bust out of the vents. That would be creepy. Oh, chill. Uh oh. Oh my god. Yo, he's stuck. He's stuck on the wall. Yo, he got a dumpy though. Yo, chill. Oh, he's just playing on the seesaw. He's a good jumbo Josh. <laughs> we only have two pictures left. We gotta choose. Oh, what is he doing? He's showing us his butt. Yo, he's ripping a nasty fart. Oh, ew, that's what that sound was? Yep. Dude, we're breathing it in. Don't you hear us? We're, we're breathing breathing quite heavily. Ah! Oh no! I took a photo! I took a photo! Oh, oh, that was too creepy, man. Yeah, I don't think I want to call anyone else. There's so many people we could ring, but I don't want to. I just want to go find all of Amanda's secret tapes. Let's get out of this game. Yeah, bro. Let's find her tapes and dip. Today, we play Amanda the Adventurer in Roblox. Pretty much, there's these super mysterious tapes, and we have to get to the bottom of what's going on. It's really creepy, so make sure you guys stick around to see what's really happening. Sonny, we're 
we're locked in the attic and uh, we have to put Amanda the Adventurer on the TV. I'm scared. I don't want to do this, Melon. Why do you always bring us to these scary horror games? I'm terrified. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Episode one. Yo, this is my favorite show. Amanda and Wooly. Hi there, I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Today, we're gonna make an apple pie. My favorite is the peach pie. What's your favorite kind of pie? Oh, we gotta choose. Uh, melon? What do we vote? What do we vote? Let's just go apple pie. Apple pie. Oh, but Wooly likes peaches. Mmm, that sounds delicious. As long as Amanda's okay. Sonny, you don't understand. Amanda's the evil one. We gotta make sure Amanda's chill with us. Oh, you for sure on that? I thought we need to make sure Wooly is cool, because Wooly kind of looked goaded. Wooly, Wooly is almost a goat, but he's actually a sheep. Okay, what can we use to cut the apples? A spoon or a pizza? Which one? Knife! Knife! Sonny! Knife! Yo, chill! She's giving her a knife! Why would you give her a knife? I'm sorry, this is really scary. A sharp knife? Why'd you have to say it's sharp? Dude, you gave her that. That's on you. It's always good to be brave when you're by yourself. Yes. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. <laughs> She's so creepy. She's not that creepy yet. Soon, though. She's got that Mickey Mouse hairdo, too. Did you notice that? Yeah, she do look like Mickey. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. What's going wrong? That was hard. This is spooky. Yeah, what is happening? We just need some sugar. I have no idea where you guys keep the sugar. This is your house. How am I supposed to know? Okay, think about it. Pantry, refrigerator, or sink? I'm gonna say the pantry. The pantry? I'll get the pantry, too. Finally, we can bake this apple pie. It's gonna be delicious. Yo, with cinnamon? Oh, that's a nice touch. Mm -mm -mm. Let's get cooked. It looks baked already. I'm not gonna lie. It looks burnt. Yeah, you're right. It is already baked. I don't think we should be using the oven by ourselves. We should always ask a parent for help. I am the goat, so I always use the stove by myself. That's what Amanda says. First, preheat the oven to 425 degrees. Remember this, Sonny? 40 minutes, 425. You are Amanda. Wooly, let's have some pie. Melon, first things first. Preheat this oven to 425. Wait, wait, Sonny, 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 Sonny. Chill, 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 chill. We were watching a movie show game, and now this oven's actually here. I know. Isn't it awesome? And then I set this thing to 40 minutes. Open up. Oh, wait, we gotta make our pie. We never made our pie, huh? We gotta insert the ingredients. Apple in tin. Okay, melon. Where you got the sugar, the flour, the eggs, and the milk, and all the other baked goods? I don't know. Let's look around in the attic. It's gotta be somewhere here. Yeah, good idea. I'm putting my apple tray in the oven. Look at it. Look at it. Two big apples, melon. Yep, Sonny, we're gonna need flour. We're gonna need some other things. Like, we need a sharp knife, remember? What did you just do? I put it in the oven, and look what we got. Episode 2! Oh, you actually did it, Sonny. Good job. Yeah, I'm smarter than you. That's why. Let's see what's on the TV next. Oh, corner store bakery and the post office. Hi, friends. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. What do you like best about your neighborhood? I don't really know, to be honest. Why does the post office got big capital F? That's great. I like that. There are so many friends in my neighborhood. I'm kind of nervous about this. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know about this one, Sonny. Why are the rooftops dancing? This is weird. Sonny, we're in a different world. Oh, she's asking where she can buy a card. I actually think it's the post office. I think you're right, Sonny. That's not right. What do you mean that's not right? Dude, corner store then. Fine. Corner store? Okay. Okay, that was scary, Sonny. I got scared. Uh-oh, she's not happy with that. Let's pick out a card together. You got it, Amanda. I'll help you find the best one when you were sad. Okay. Oh, you should definitely give them a birthday card to get well soon or... Yeah, thank you for being sad. That's what I voted. Yep, thank you very much. Wait, what? We're sending them a thank you card for being sad? It's the perfect card, Sonny. Oh, wait, no. Amanda was sad and they give something nice to her. That's why. Mm, oh, I see. So now she's saying thank you. Yeah, I was wrong there. Well, we were right, actually. Yeah, true. In being wrong, we were correct. I was trying to troll Amanda, but it turns out we trolled ourselves. By being right. And that means we survived. So kind of worth it. Oh, special treat. A special treat. We gotta get to the bakery. We gotta get baked goodies. Give me that bakery. Wait, we already made apple pie. What else do we need to bake? Some bread. Mm, everything smells so good. Delicious. I want to buy some. Uh-oh. Melon, this is going really wrong. Sweets should I buy my friend? I'm thinking... Do you think cupcakes or cookies? I think she's a cake kind of girl. All right, cake. I got the cake. I said cake. Dude, dude, what the heck? Cookies. 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 Those look so tasty. Good, good. 
good. Okay, in the neighborhood. Why is she typing like that? I don't know, man. This is weird. The cupcakes and cookies are ready. Okay, we need to get to the post office. And we need to make it quick, Melon. I have to send this to my friends. Time to go over to the post office. I'm sweating, bro. I'm nervous. Dude, why do all of the employees look weird? The box has eyeballs on it. Sunny. Amanda took their nose and their mouth. What is their friend's name? That's not good. She doesn't even remember. Uh. Big Man Melon. Send it to Big Man Melon. Uh. I don't remember the name. I don't think we ever learned the name. I think you're right. Okay, she's sending it right now, Melon. We need to use our brains. Okay. Package needs to go to... Let's see the options. Oh, boy. Should she send it to herself? Amanda sends it to Amanda? Yep. That's not my friend. Dang it! Uh, Kate? Kate? Maybe Kate? You think Kate? I think it's Big Dave, but I'll vote Kate. It's Kate. It's gotta be Kate, bruh. Yeah! Let's go! We're doing it! Send out the cookies! I hope she likes cookies, too. Okay, so that means we're gonna have to do something similar here. We need to get cookies for Kate. Wait, why are we playing a piano? Click on the keys that correspond with the letters. Okay. Uh... Yeah, I'm really confused here. Something around here. Melon, we went to the corner store, then the bakery. Oh, wait, there's no post office. I can't do that. Um, corner stores, bakery. There's no post office. Oh, it was an F. Corner store. Yo, CBF. It worked. Yeah, I'm a genius. I know. What was the, th what was the F? Uh, post office. Oh, I see. The entire tape was just a distraction. Episode three, Melon. What's gonna happen? Wooly. Oh. Oh, it's you. Yes, it is, Wooly. Whatever, do do don't, uh, don't, uh, oh gosh. What? Oh no. Wait, what's going on? What? Wooly, Wooly sad. Wooly sad. Amanda's gonna go evil mode. Wooly had an accident? <laughs> Amanda, do you have anything to do with this? Yeah, thanks for explaining what an accident is, but I suspect it was your fault. Accidents can happen in your house at school or at the playground. You can get hurt almost everywhere. Bruh, she is evil. At 3.45 this afternoon, where I will play Wooly tripped and fell. I didn't trip! Where on Wooly does it look like he got hurt? Uh, his knee. His knee. It looks like he hurt his knee. <laughs> She's so happy. That's right. Wooly hurt his knee. Let's go. <laughs> Who can help me when you are hurting? Uh, the dentist is probably pretty good. The doctor. Yeah, it was the doc. It was the big old doc. Unless it's Dr. Toby, then you gotta run for your life. Yeah, Dr. Toby ain't nice. If your knee's hurting, it'll amputate your arm. What's gonna be on the table? Oh, the door's opening. Oh, ah! we're going to the hospital. What is happening? Let's go. We can get out of here, Sonny. We can get out. Hospital. I entered the door. Wait, where are we? Yo, we're in the game, Sonny. Finally. Don't run across the street yet, Melon. Too late. I think I might have got hit by a car. We're getting honked at, bro. These cars are not happy. Uh, I don't know. We just spawned over here. Don't get hit by a car. <laughs> Sonny, we gotta get over there in 40 seconds. Yo, we gotta go. I know. And she's laughing at us. Oh, can't dodge him like that. Juked. I sprint this way. And it, can I make it? Can I make it? Oh, I'm quick with it. Oh, I'm quick with the sauce, but to go to with the sauce. Yo, Melon, you are too quick, bro. You're too speedy sometimes. Bro, I already made it. Let's go. I'm with Wooly and Amanda. Yeah, me too. I'm going to the petting zoo, though. You guys made it. Yeah. Today, we're going to the petting zoo. Stop talking with that weird voice. I want to pet chickens. Okay, okay. Let's go and get some pet chickens. Wait, why is she swimming in the ground? What is happening? Oh, okay. They're good now. Yo, chill. All right. What? A cute fam? Wait, what do you mean fam? Farm? Ah! Yeah, that's right, Willie. You are she. Having a family is nice. I see a mommy and a baby chicken. Chickens lay eggs. What is going on? I have a bad feeling she's going to eat the eggs. Yep. Can you help me find seven eggs? All right, I'll look for seven eggs. Oh, got one. Ooh, got one too. Pick it up another one. Yeah, buddy. And then Amanda's going to scramble these eggs and make us a delicious breakfast using the mama chicken's babies. Dude, that sounds so brutal. It's a little bit evil. Ain't gonna lie. Where's this last egg? Mel, did you miss an egg? Oh, I found it. I found it. It's behind this tree. We're being sneaky. Okay, we did it. Great job. No problem, Amanda. We got you back. We're the real goats out here. Uh-oh. What's going on? Oh, it's a cat. Hi, little kitten. Where's your family? <laughs> Wait, what's going on? That kitten looks so real. It looks like a giant cat. I don't even know if that's a kitten. It's huge. True. I think she feels lonely. Mm, I think she feels sad. But it's such a cute little pretty cat. There's nobody to love her. It's just sad. Nobody to help her. Will you help the lonely kitten? Uh, yeah, I'll help her out.
Why not? No. I said I would help her. What do you mean? What do you mean? What's going on? What's happening? What is happening? Melon? Uh, I think Amanda's about to go crazy. Oh, no. She's flying. Oh, what is happening? We're trying to help Amanda. Hey, chill, chill. That's creepy. Sonny, we gotta run. But where are we running? Just stay away from her, Sonny. We've got to survive. Oh, no. Oh, no. Sonny, look out. Look out. She's on to you. Ow, she hurt me. She hurt me. All right, well, I'm gonna just let her chase you. Why? Why is she only after me? Amanda, chill. I'm up the tree. She can't get me up the tree. She can get me up the tree. Are you kidding? Well, Sonny, uh, you're doing great. Wait, no. Why is she on to me now? No. Get Lock back on to Sonny. No. That's right. That's what you get. Now I'm safe and you're not. Wait, she can't get me up here. Ow, she can. Told you she could climb trees. She's crazy. Nah, she can't climb this one no more. No way. Yes, I have defeated Amanda. Same. I'm way up in this treetop. Uh, is Amanda good? Is she chilling? Wait, wait. Why is she being creepy? Oh, I don't know, man. I don't know. Wait, what just happened? Yo! Yo, we got launched. Ow! Uh-oh. Oh, she's rising up. Uh-oh. Yo, Amanda, you need to chill. Oh, no, her head! Ew! What is happening? Sonny, this is weird! Wait, I have a bat. Yeah, I have a bat, too. Ah! We got a fighter, bro! I'm moving in! Smack! Hit it where it hurts, Sonny. Hit it where it hurts. I'm trying to smack her, but it's not working. I can't do any damage. Maybe now. Oh, now. Ow, ow. Ow, ow, she's hurting me. Zero damage still. What the heck is this? All right, Sonny, we gotta chill. We gotta chill. We gotta wait for our opportunity. We need to find our time to strike. You're almost dead, Sonny. Yo, now's our chance. What the heck? I wasn't ready. Let's go. Yes. Yes. Ah, run. Oh, you're dead. Revive. I got Robux on me. Don't worry. You got them bucks? I got the bucks. Zuck bucks. I got all the big dollar bills. And then I acquire the ultimate weapon. Give me this sword. Let's go. Wait, I'm stuck in a corner. Hurry up, Sonny. Hurry up. I'm coming in with the big weapon. Amanda never stood a chance. Bang. Let's go. Yo, you're destroying her. Oh, she's dead. She's dead. Yes. You never stood a chance, Amanda. Yeah, go back into your haunted world. We did it, Melon. Help me. Well, maybe if you weren't being so mean, we would. Yeah. Who episode four? I thought we won. I'm nervous about this one, Melon. Yeah. Put in the tape, Sonny. I'm putting it in the VHS. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. This is not good. Amanda got hurt. Yeah, that's right. You don't play with Sonny and Melon. Can we forgive her, Sonny? I think yes, for the sake of the adventure. All right, I'll say no. All right, well, let's see what happens. Good idea, yeah. Dang it! Thank you, Wooly. What have you done? What have you done, Sonny? She's gonna destroy us. I wonder what type of medicine we're gonna give her. A hammer? scissors oh i guess just teleport her what have you done she's fine bro she's cool now is she i don't know i don't like this sunny she's zooming i told you we shouldn't have helped her i told you she's gonna be thankful look she's gonna say wow guys you're so nice thank you is she i don't know buddy i don't know <laughs> she's on the ceiling yo chill wait what she killed us good job sunny we died because of you hey we got the bad ending for doing a good deed. You know what the saying is, no good deed goes unpunished. Today, Sonny and I pick a door. One out of these three doors will let us live and advance to the next level, but the other two will kill us in crazy ways. Stick around to see if Sonny and I make it to the end. Sonny, it's time to pick a door. Which one you want? I'm choosing door number two because I'm the second, which is the best. First, the worst, second, the best. Open up. Right, I'm going to go number one because ah! I'm the best. Why? I'm number one. Why yes. did a poopy doge come out of door number two? Ah, door number one killed me. I tried to bait you, dude. <laughs> Door number one killed me, Sonny. Don't go in door number one. Nice try, bro. I tried opening one and two so that poopy doge would kill you. Look, Melon, poopy doge. I'm... It's killing me, Sonny. I don't know what you're talking about. You're such a liar, bro. I'm through the door. Door you're... number three worked. <laughs> you're such a scammer. Hey, I tried. I tried. Now we got to do some parkour to get to the next doors. It's funny that you were trying to scam me because that's what I was doing to you. Oh, I fell. I think we need to choose one of the next doors next. I'm going to let you choose wisely, Melon. Pick one that's a loser, so. It's obviously number three. It's not even. Ah! Nice. Uh, it's door number two this time. I think I'm good. Oh, no. Door number three actually was wrong. Oh, no! <sighs> Melon, door number two was correct, but this place is scary. What are these monsters? Run! Yo, this is so cursed. 
I don't know why. What happened to these people? Just make the jumps. Watch out, bro. Door number one. <gasps> I did it. Is it? It is door number one. Let's go. First try. Ow! What is that thing? Wait. <laughs> How come you died? Bro, what? Wait, he's here. Why is he here now? I don't understand. I don't understand. I got the checkpoint, though. I'm good. I'm blowing you up. Uh, you just blowed yourself up. Wait, idiot. you survived? Idiot. Idiot. You're an idiot sandwich. Nice one, Melon. You're the idiot sandwich now. I'm not a criminal, sir. All right, Doge, but we still don't trust you. I'm going to open this one, Melon. I'm um, open this one. Is this safe? No, it's not. I'm going to get eaten. I'm dead. Uh-oh. What is this? Karen? No! She spoke to the manager and killed me. All right, Melon, process of elimination. Which door did you open? Uh, top left. Hey, don't even be lying to me. We need to do this intelligently. I'm serious right now. I'm opening this one. All right, I'll get this one. Oh, oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Am I alive? No, I'm not in Siren Head. Dang it. Yes, I found the right one. It's the bottom middle. Nice try, Melon. It's top middle. <laughs> no. You think I'm going to fall for that? You think I'm born yesterday? Yeah. Victory! You are actually born 7 billion years ago. I guess because the universe was formed. No, I'm here's the sun. 13 billion years ago, dude, the first atoms in the universe were born, and that means we were born. Oh, yes, dude. I'm so confused. Which door do we go down? This one. I'm thinking it's going to be the last door on the left. Oh yeah. my gosh. What? 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 Melon? Hello? Why are you I'm here? So, I'm so confused. What, that was what's weird. going on? Why were you there? What? What is happening? Uh, e equals MC squared melon. I found it. I actually did. I'm a mathematician. I'm a genius. Bro, I'm so confused. What do you mean you found it? I did the same thing. Second just... door on the left. Second door on the left. Second to last oh. door on the left, I mean. Nope, you're capping. You're capping. I'm not. Second to last. It has the E equals MC squared. I'm Bro, all capping. of them have E equals MC squared. Every oh. single one has E equals MC squared. Well, then I got lucky because the second door to the end on the left got me here, and I'm way ahead I'm of you. I'm so lost right now. It's Baldy and Jeff. Jeff. Why is Baldy here? Hey, you're right. It was the second door on the left. See, I, I wasn't trying to troll you. I wasn't. No, I wanted you to win. Jeff, Jeff, let me through. Oh, and then we got, uh, we got Piggy. Uh, hold on the wall. Let me through. Let me through. You did it, Mel. I'm proud of you. Where'd I leave the key to this door? It must be around here somewhere, says the Dogington. Uh-oh. Uh, I don't see it anywhere around here. I'm watching you, Melon. I feel like you already found it. I don't know where it is, Sonny. Okay, but if you randomly leave the game because you found the key and you didn't want to tell me about it, I'll be very... Okay, I I'm dead. No! I not find the key anywhere. The Rock! He RKO'd me! Uh, I did not find the key, Sonny. You did. You did. This room. Did I know? In the laundry. Inside the laundry. Dang it! You're not supposed to find out. Melon, you should go in the other bedroom. It's very fun. Ah, why did my body go? Yo, what the heck was that? I could control my body and it was flying everywhere. I want to do that again. Open up, door. Give me that checkpoint. Are you trying to get run over by these tires? No, I'm not. All right, fine. Uh, door two, door number two. Oh, that looks yeah, spooky. You should go in there. No! Why does Five Nights at Freddy's have an elephant trunk? No! Why does the door on the right have Five Nights at Freddy's? You're a liar. Oh no. You're oh, a no. liar. Oh no. Wait, you weren't a liar. Oh no. It's Foxy. Well, I did lie. <laughs> I did. said the door on the right. And now I'm dead. Dang it. Yo, so I'm crossing the doors. This is scary, Melon. Checkpoint. Okay, not scary. We're good. Yes, yeah, Sonny, don't even worry. Don't even worry. Now we need to enter one of these elevators. I'm right behind you. Did that one work for you? I don't know. I'm going to find out. See ya. Bye. Hey, it worked. Let's go. You're a liar. You're a filthy liar. 
I'm, I, I'm, I'm not lying, bro. I'm telling the truth. Thing is, you could lie, and it would still mean I don't want to do it. Baldy! Baldy didn't attack me. The pig? Yes, yeah, I just the pig. I don't know if I'm lying. I don't know if I'm lying. I, I, uh, uh, Slenderman? I Dude. died. A horrible death. Pennywise? No! Pennywise! Dang so, it. Which one did you do, Sonny? I went on the one on the left. All right, time to do the center one. Wait, why are you doing the middle one? What the heck are you doing? What are you doing? I'm in the right one. Can I come in too? It won't let me in. See ya. It won't let me in. I'll tell you, Sonny. You can trust me. Yeah, that elevator is going to kill you. I lied to you, Melon. I lied to your face, and now I'm taking the correct elevator. No! You wouldn't! Oh, but I would. Oh, but I would. Okay, Melon, I'm on the next area of this map, and I am leaving you in the dust so I can pick all the doors. Uh, oh, wait, I'm Sonny, dead. wait. I got lazy. I, I've literally been loyal this whole time. You've not been loyal at all. Checkpoint. Uh, what, are you, what are you talking about? You go first, I'll follow, says the doge. Sure thing, buddy boy. Sure thing. Wait for me, Sonny. I'm scared. Nope. You're scared and soon to be alone. Well, that's a pit of death. It wasn't a pit of death? Are you serious? Melon! I'm amazing! I'm the best that there ever was at picking doors. What do you mean, bro? Okay, so this one's obviously two. Please, please be the right path. Please! <laughs> I'm waiting down here, bro. I'm flossing on you. Hey, oh, this was not the right path. Uh -oh. I will wait here at the bottom of the pit for you, Melon. Hitting you with that floss. I don't even know which door it is. Red is always right. Yes. Hey, what up, Sonny? It's obviously chest number one. Nope, that uh, looks like death uh -oh. in the form of the rock. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. No! Chest three. I can't open it. Chest two? Ooh. It's not chest two. It won't give me the key. Am I glitched? Oh, no, I got the key. I'm good. Yo, we made it to the next level. And now we jump across. Oh. Oh, the barrels <laughs> disappear. Okay. We were not ready for that. You gotta go quick. You got to go quick. Move and groove, or die and burn a horrible death. Yes. All right, Sonny, I'm going to be honest with this next door, okay? Okay. Let's see if you get lucky with it. That's McDonald's. I died. Me too. I'm going to be honest with this. I survived. Which door? I mean, I said I would be honest. I told you I survived. I never told you I'd tell you which door. Dude, you're so annoying. You definitely went... To oh, I was the middle. <laughs> it was, it was the middle one. And now I am under the sea. Are you sure this is a good idea? I'm not sure any of this is a good idea. But I'm opening the center. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Oh. Melon. What? You got oofed by Squidward. No. Let me out of here. <laughs> nice Dang try. Dang it. I thought you were going to go through that door for sure. Uh, is this the right one? Brothers stick together. Nope. It is I'm not the right you. one. How do you know? How do you know? Uh-oh. Told you. Chad, Bob. I told you. Dang it, Bob. SpongeBob, me boy. Not me. SpongeBobulus has eliminated us. This has got to be the correct door. Uh, you're right. It must be statistically speaking the correct door, or it would be impossible. Unless it was a secret door and we're all dead. Sonny, I know a secret trick to increase our odds of beating the door. Okay, Sonny, you ready? Yeah, what's that? Pick a door. If you pick a door and it's wrong, then I had already picked a door and then I switch my choice of the door, then I'll statistically be more likely. So I'm gonna go middle. Okay, I went left and I'm dead. Okay, so odds are if I go to the right one, I have a better odds of winning. And I'm right. Let's go! I've won! No, you're capping. Where is he? Hey, you did win! You hey, actually hey. did! What? Let's go down the slide. How does that make any logical sense? 
Math, math, Sonny, the math, maths. The math don't math to my mathematically inclined brain of numbers. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. And click the next video on screen to watch us play Pick a Slide. Let's go.